everybody so i know you guys see the background i'll get into that um you know another video but i just want to switch it up a bit and um so you guys can focus on me um before i get into it please um well, sorry welcome to all my new subscribers my, subscribers my viewers and my followers thank you for staying tuned to those of you that have been with me for a while and thank you for subscribing and following and viewing my channel another thing is um before I get started with the 2014 products that my hair does not like, I want to give a disclaimer to you guys. And um, I want to say that I'm not here to bash any products or anything like that. I'm here to give my honest reviews. And you guys know that I've been following me for a while. I do give my honest reviews. I want to. I don't want to sit here and falsify and give you false reviews just because of a if a brand is a big you know is a big brand or because a lot of people you know rave about it. If my hair doesn't like it, it doesn't like it. So I'm not gonna sit here and be like, oh my hair likes it. You know, this is anything when my hair is under distress. Okay. So um yeah, I'm not about that you know telling you lies life okay so i'm um, that's basically about that um so i'm here to tell you the truth and give you honest and you know honest reviews so that's what i'm here for um three products that i'm going to talk about um first well the first three products i'm going to talk about they do not have reviews on it because simply because i forgot or i was just too busy to do it so i just didn't do it and it was a while ago so yeah and these products i have for excuse me for a minute and um two of them in the trash because they, they got they went bad they are natural products and one of them is sultanicals not sauce okay i know you're throwing bricks throwing bricks stop throwing bricks at me <laughs> throwing tomatoes ouch in my head that always stop being silly but um yeah so the not sauce um well i was in my life i did try it four or five times i did try it four or five times i believe it's like an all-in-one type deal and if it's not um you know don't um you know check me um don't quote me um you know i believe it's a deep conditioner leave-in um a detangler or what have you um it i wasn't about that like rinse out i just use it as detangling purposes i believe i use it as a leave-in um it was okay it wasn't wowing me i do have other products that you know wow me better than the not sauce um you know everybody I was like, yeah, then I saw this and that other thing. I'm like, Ugh. I was like, blah. So I had to throw it away because it went bad, and that's my fault. I should have given given it away to somebody or you know what have you instead of just letting it go bad and just chilling my stash, which was wrong. So I'm not wasting money and just it just went to waste. Um, so yeah, so I, I wasn't about that life. Um, the next part of Bisotanicals was the Mango Dip Detangling Slip. Now, I solely used it for detangling. I don't know if it's for other purposes, um, but I was just like, no. Um, uh, my hair, I was trying to detangle, and it was just like, uh, it was detangling, but it was taking a minute to detangle, so I'm just like, no. I need something with, like, you know, slippage, if that's a word, like, like real slip that I could just, you know, really go through, like, that melts my tangles, like, you know, very nicely. And um, that didn't do that, so I'm just like, no, I'm not gonna sit here and waste money on something that's not really, you know, detangling, you know, what I'm supposed to do. So, no. So I just was like, no. So that one in the trash too, and also that was separated as well. Like it was chilling. I didn't open it to smell to see what it smells like. It probably smelled bad, but I don't know. And um, the the first the first one that I did have that I got from Black Friday, it was running. I had to send her an email and I showed her, you know, the video. I have a little clip because one of my girlfriends pointed out that theirs was thicker than mine, and I was like, wow. So that what that's what prompted prompt me to um to send her an email and she did send you know um another one you know quickly but um her shipping is a little bit slow i don't know how it is now but um it's like a good month so if you're about that weight in life then you can order from there but i'm not and i don't you know really like i don't like the product so you know um my hair is like no so anyway it doesn't really matter um, but that's basically about that. So that's neither here nor there. So that's it for that those products there Um, the third product that I want to talk about is the Coco Curls natural hair care hydrating shampoo sulfate free Now I didn't do a review on this, but I wanted to show you guys how it separated it at the bottom And um, I did you know record this video. I don't know how many times So I'm going to show a clip of where I showed you where it separated and how I shake it and it went to back to this um to this um opaque color um it's very very liquidy um i know it's a liquid shampoo duh but you know i it's like really liquidy like you're shaking it, it's like mad runny like there's no type of consistency type deal you know like it's not like a a nice oozy it's like real runny so i don't know i'll put it on my hand i don't know if i'm ODing, but it's just like uh and then like i remember one of my curl friends and um it's all about the curls group was asking the same thing like you know they was asking 
I'm sorry, asking, you know, did any, was anybody else who was ru running or, you know, the consistency and things of that nature? And I told her, mine was like running. Mine, mine, mine was running. So, um, it was just like, no. So, it was like running all the place, running all my hand, put on my head and running. So, I'm like, no. I, I, I got this in my curl collection. I just was like, nah, you know. So, I may try it again. I don't know. Maybe later on down the line. I'm not sure. But I, I guess I'm ODing because it's... You know, I mean, but it really didn't do nothing for my hair. I mean, you know, so fair free shampoo. I mean, it's just, it wasn't a wow factor. It wasn't something for me to fall in love with. I'll try it again. Maybe I'll revisit it. Don't quote me. But um, I'm not going to throw it away just yet. But it's not, it's, it's no. It's really kind of no anyway. So, yeah, it's just no. All right, so I didn't do, you know, reviews on that. So those were just little short reviews that I wanted to let you guys know about. So, yeah, so this one is the Cleansing Conditioning Natural Licious Step 1. It's the Moroccan Razul 5-in-1 Clay Treatment. Now, I did a review on the Wavy Edition or what have you. Um, I don't know what's the difference. They both have the same ingredients. Um, she said something under my... Um, video in the comments saying you know it's different it's i don't know if the 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 i don't know the consistency is different but this sounds watery now i had this for a minute so um i didn't use this one i used the other one i only i, I was going to use this one to see what was the difference um i may still do that ho hopefully if this didn't go bad but um i don't know i just you know it, it didn't give me the wow factor um it's supposed to be all in one so um it you know it's supposed to you know detangle condition and you know leave in and stuff like that but i had the dc when i used clay mask but um i put it on my scalp so it didn't feel like it really did what it was supposed to do it didn't feel like a clay mask to me um so i just you know I, I wasn't about this life so i'm not bashing it it's just that i wasn't really about this life so it was just like no for me for this um again i used the one in the yellow bottle it said wavy edition like again like i said before i don't see what's the difference i'm still confused so um yeah that's basically about that so this didn't this this wasn't about the i know i'm not gonna buy this again no 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 Okay, last but certainly not least is the Wonder Curl Detoxifying Clay Cleanser Cleanse, Detangle, and Moisturize. Um, this was no. I got this in my curl collection. No. I did a review on this. It's no. Okay? It's no. It's just no. This is a big no. Okay? <laughs> um, I know I'm probably going to get bricks thrown at me, but um, um, I don't know if I heard a good review on this. I'm not sure. But um, I'm not going to open this because it smells bad now. Um, it didn't smell like anything before, but I guess because it's, it's, it's a natural product. Um, I had it for a minute. I got this in my curl collection a while ago. And um, it was, I wasn't about this. I only used this one time and that was it. I should have gave it to somebody or let somebody else try it or what have you as opposed to letting it, you know, get, you know, old and have, having to throw it away. You know, it's basically kind of a waste of money. Um, but this basically just sat on top of my hair. It did not. It felt like some type of conditioner or something I was putting on my hair. It did not feel like a clay max at all. I had to use use a shampoo i had to use a shampoo with a chelator in it to get this out of here out of my hair because i didn't want this in my hair because it wasn't doing anything it was just sitting there chilling like la 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 like you know what am i doing here <laughs> the eating and body works that's like my um my emergency shampoo a little bit you know to you know if anything that's in my hair that i don't want in there you know get it out type shampoo um so um that's what i used and it definitely did cleanse that out but um no mm -mm, no I uh, did a review on that as well. I'll put all the reviews in the description bar below. Um, but no, that's just no, okay? Um, my hair did not like that at all. My hair was just like hating me after that. But, you know, it was just crazy. So, yeah, we good now. We good now. So, um, but that's basically about that. So that's it. Those are the products that my hair did not like in the 2014. Those are the ones that stood out to me. I'm not sure if there are any more products that my hair didn't like. But those are the products that... Um, that stood out to me that I did not like that my hair was just like basically no okay again I'm not bashing any product I'm not bashing any you know um, you know anybody that's making these products um, it is what it is um, everybody's hair is different and again I don't want to scare you from you you guys not you know buying these products um, you could try these products you know I recommend you to try them you know and see if your hair likes them because just because my hair doesn't like it you know doesn't mean your hair won't like it you know so Whatever works, whatever don't work in my hair may work in your hair and vice versa. So just remember that, you know, everybody's hair is different. But, you know, just to give you guys, you know, so you guys can get, you know, you know, 
make a, a good decision based on certain reviews you know it's up to you at the end of the day it's your money and it's what you want to buy and what you want your hair to go through if your hair does not like it okay <laughs> so that's basically it you know that's the trials and tribulations of um a hair journey of trying different products and being a product junkie is not helping it either so <laughs> yeah you know so i'm trying to recover but you know yeah I, i've been doing okay i guess but anyway, um, that's basically about that. So yeah, oh, one more thing I wanted to say about curl color. Yeah, the um, the Wonder Curl. It was oozing out. Um, I did. It's it's in my video, so you guys will see. It was oozing out. Um, when it first happened, when it first, when I first got it, maybe it was too much compacted in there. So I do do talk about that part in um my video. I'm mean, in my um uh my review. So definitely go check those reviews out. Hopefully I'll put them in there and not have Will Feeling Latest for like three months. Uh, so you guys go check it out. If not, just type in the name of the, you know, whatever the name of the product is and it should pop up in the um, search bar or whatever like that. But I definitely will try to put it in the description bar below so you guys can have a quick access to it, okay? And go and then see what's going on, okay? But that's basically it, you guys. I'm done. Um... That's basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Those are the products that my hair did not like. Um, and one little quick tip, sorry, tip that I want to give you guys. Um, my um, big sis, um, Diva Dev, had, um, has done a video on this about how products that, you know, natural products, you know, whatever products that you have, you know, um, you know, not, you know, not letting them go to waste or how, you know, products that she had that she had to throw away, which was a waste of money. So basically, if you have any products, especially natural products, if you don't like them, use them once or twice, you know, call up Susie's you know um joe or somebody I'm like you know hey i got this product here i don't like it or sell it to somebody go on ebay you know do a giveaway instagram giveaway youtube giveaway whatever you're doing twitter giveaway i don't know um and give it away as opposed to just you know seeing yourself literally throwing it in the garbage okay so um that was you know kind of hard for me because it's like i purchased these products and i have to throw them away like you know throw them in the garbage because it's just like uh so you know lesson learned you know if i don't like the product just give it to somebody like hello you want this product oh all right okay cool you know you know you know work out some negotiations you know swap you know stuff like that so that's basically about that um so i'm done i'm done um you know so i'm out of here i'm talking too much now and so that's basically it, you guys so if you have any questions comment concerns please don't ask me in my comments below the in the box or get some more key and i see you in the gym and i'll come on up and see you thanks for watching peace